Text or call us, 877-310-4MSJ. Lots of ways to jump in, and the email is just burning up today. So, guys, this is from <laughs> Bobby. Bobby with an I. Okay. Hi, Bobby. Uh, um, heard the story, Jody, about your walk and the raccoon. <laughs> You guys remember what Bobby's talking about? Oh, the raccoon uh, with the napkins attached to his hands? Yeah, it was a poor dead raccoon that someone had moved out of the middle of the street with napkins so that they wouldn't have to touch the hands, but mm-hmm. just put it on the side of the street and then left, and the raccoon was up there with the hands yeah. up and the napkins on the hands for uh, several days where, where I walk. It was sad. <laughs> He's gone now, by the way. I don't know what Whoa. happened to oh, him. Oh, okay. The napkins I'm remained going. for a while. Yeah, anyway. Sam was thinking that you walked back in a dinner scene evolved no. or something like that. <laughs> Some <laughs> other sort of taxidermy-related thing. Bobby sent this. I thought I would share a similar experience. A raccoon was hit by a car at a turn I take when coming home every day. Mm. It was during winter and off the road, so it stayed there for a long while. Eventually, someone tied a balloon to the, t- <laughs> to the tail. What? And the balloon read, get well soon. (laughs) Really? A a few days later, someone ran over the balloon. (laughs) A couple of days later, the raccoon was removed. A shrine was erected to the raccoon. A shrine? And votive candles, a cross, and flowers. (laughs) That was eventually removed. (laughs) Months later... Towards the end of summer, a sign was erected that read, Gone but not forgotten, (laughs) with a picture of a raccoon. Oh, Oh, man. Beside it was another sign that read, Rocky the Raccoon. Oh, Oh, Bobby. Bless you for sharing that with us. See, that's a perfect example of why the city wants to get out there and clean something up quickly versus leaving it for a while. I have to applaud all of that. No. Yeah. That's all genius. All of it. Genius. Genius. Well, genius. And you think it's hysterical. I, I know. I know. It's that not could appropriate. Have been, that could have been driven, all of that, Bobby, by a child who was so sad to see your their first ever, you know, roadkill. You just never know. That's true. It that could have been a mom or a dad going, you know what, let's help, you know, little Johnny through this yeah. by saying goodbye. Yeah. I know that you think get well soon with the balloon is hysterical, but... <laughs> Thank you, Bobby. Yeah, uh, jump in anytime. 877 <laughs> 310 4MSJ.